Praise is what I do, saints. It's Sister with a Testimony, and we're going to be talking about strong delusion brought on by lying spirits. You will first encounter the lying spirit sent by God in 1 Kings chapter 22, verses 19 through 22, bringing delusion, strong delusion to Ahab. And he said, Hear thou, therefore, the word of the Lord. I saw the Lord sitting on his throne, and all the host of heaven standing by him on his right hand and on his left. And the Lord said, Who shall persuade Ahab that he may go up and fall at Ramoth Gilead? And one said on this manner, and another said on that manner. And there came forth a spirit, and stood before the Lord, and said, I will persuade him. And the Lord said unto him, Wherewith? And he said, I will go forth and I will be a lying spirit in the mouth of all his prophets. And he said, Thou shalt persuade him and prevail also. Go forth and do so. In 1 Thessalonians chapter 2, verse 11, the word, the Holy Scripture, reads on this wise. And for this cause, God shall send them strong delusion that they should believe a lie, that they might all be damned who believed not the truth, but had pleasure in unrighteousness. Saints, when we're dealing with strong delusion, it's brought on by sin. Be sure that your sin will find you out and your sin will separate you from the Lord. It's very simple, saints, when you're dealing with delusion. Delusion comes from deception. Delusion, it can be considered a mental illness. But when we're dealing with the spiritual realm, if you deal with the spiritual realm and the spirit man, the physical man is usually healed immediately or progressively depending on the thought process and the willingness to forgive and be forgiven and to change and transform. Let's talk about delusion, saints. This weapon causes us to hold on to false perceptions, images, concepts, and beliefs. All these opinions are usually generated by demons and people embrace them as if they were truth and reality. The delusion may manifest itself in many ways. Persecutory, grandiose, jealousy. This, the type of jealousy that is considered erotic. It's not true love. It's, it's a sensual, weird sort of jealousy. Then you also have delusional, grandiose ideas that can bring on false beliefs, such as having a physical abnormality or disorder, which is not even there, like a false pregnancy. Then a folie au deux, an extremely rare type of shared delusion, resulting from a close relationship with another delusional person. This is a weapon that is used by the enemy to destroy people, saints. And yes, the Lord will allow it when we continually disobey him and give ourselves over to the lies. He will give us over to our wants and our strong delusions and desires. If you want to be set free from this, you must be set free through the power of Yahushua HaMashiach, Jesus Christ of Nazareth, the Holy Spirit, Ruach HaKodesh, living in and through you. You must be willing to forgive, and you must be willing to repent and live holy, saints. If you want to be free, there's no quick fix. There's no formula. It's called presenting yourself on the sacrificial altar, dying to self, and crying out to God for mercy. But there is a counterattack against delusion, saints. And that's putting on the truth. Saints, when you put the truth on, nothing can stand in your way. 
And if it does, it will be annihilated by that truth. So we're going to pray today against the delusions. According to God's word in John 8, 32, you will know the truth and the truth will set you free. Come together, saints. Gather together and pray against delusion, strong delusion and lying spirits, deceiving spirits. Bind every spirit that twists and perverts your mind and thoughts and ask the Lord to place truth in your heart and to deliver you from all delusions. The whole world will be deceived, saints. Don't be a part of the world. We are called out of the world, out of the darkness, into the marvelous light. Father God, we come against delusion, deception, lying spirits, the spirit of error, and strong delusion. Father God, we ask you to forgive us. Search us, Lord. Search our hearts. Try us, Father God, and reward us according to your righteousness. The blood of Yahushua Hamashiach is against you, Hasatan. The blood of Yahushua Hamashiach speaks greater things than the blood of Abel. We're standing on the blood of the Lamb, covering us, hiding us, protecting us, restoring us, reconciling us, rejuvenating us. Delusion, you have no right here. Lying spirits, you have no right here. For the Lord God Almighty has put his hand of approval upon us. And in Yahushua Hamashiach's name, we disagree with every lie, every delusion, every strong delusion, and every lying spirit, every deceiver, and every deception. And we speak to the spirit of error. We command you, spirit of error, get out in Yahushua Hamashiach's name. The blood of Yahushua Hamashiach is against you. And we loose the spirit of truth the spirit of righteousness, the spirit of holiness, the spirit of a holy, sound, righteous mind. No longer double-minded, but we have our focus on Yahushua, on his word, and on the truth. And according to John chapter 8, verse 32, we will know the truth, and the truth will set us free. Father God, we receive the truth today. We receive the, the holiness and the reconciliation of the truth flooding our minds. Fill us, Lord. Fill us. Fill us. Holy Spirit. Ruach HaKadosh, the spirit of holiness. Fill us from the top of our heads to the soles of our feet. No error will come against us, infiltrate us, and have rule and reign ever again in Yahushua's name. Because the truth is... Yahushua HaMashiach, the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes unto the Father except by Yahushua. Lord, help us to live in the truth. And as the whole world comes under the lies of Hasatan, let us be delivered through your word, who is Yahushua HaMashiach, the truth. Father God, we thank you for the blood of the Lamb. We thank you for truth. And we thank you that strong delusion, delusion, deception, error, lies, deceit, no longer will have a foothold in our lives. And we just give you all the glory, all the honor, and all the praise. Because as we come with your word and counter, counterattack the enemy's delusions, we are set free daily. And we no longer conform to this world because we are completely and totally transformed by the renewing of our minds. And our minds are set on you, Lord. In Yahushua's name, a sister with a testimony, praise is what I do, prayer is what I do. I love you, God bless you, and I plead and apply the blood of Yahushua Hamashiach over your mind, your will, and your emotions. No longer will you sit in delusion, but you will stand in truth. In Yahushua's name, amen.